All right. Uh, for those of you who've been here the past couple of weeks, uh, you know that this is uh, Miss Teresa Smith uh, coming all the way down from Michigan uh, to uh, find a young man uh, to get hitched with. And uh, <laughs> that or he, I don't know how this all transpired, but uh, Scott finally found somebody that would marry him, so, you know. <laughs> We appreciate you for doing that, <laughs> taking care of him. But now, seriously, uh, Teresa has she came to me one morning and said, "I need to talk to you." And so we spent that evening uh, talking about spiritual things, about her life, and she wanted to be baptized. And I told her, I said, "Well, in order for one to be baptized, you must uh, be a candidate for baptism, which means you have to be saved." And uh, so we talked about that, and she assured me of her salvation. And uh, I said, well, there's no reason to stop you from being baptized then. So uh, she got this date set up, and uh, we are here to observe one of the ordinances that Jesus left the church to remember and to observe and remember. And baptism is a uh, picture ordinance of uh, his death, burial, and resurrection. It's a picture of when we go down in the water, it's like dying to our old self, kind of like the song says. And and in being resurrected, coming up a new person, a new creature in Christ, and uh, going to be living our life for the Lord. And so it's an important decision, and uh, I'm just very thankful for her decision, and uh, celebrate her decision uh, today. And I told her, she's kind of bashful, and I said, that, these people ain't going to hurt you. <laughs> so don't be scared of these folks. Uh, I told her everybody's on her side and excited about yeah. this decision that she's made. So, Miss Teresa, if you... Eric, you'll come help get me in the Teresa, upon your profession of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ, I baptize you, my sister, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Church said. Amen. Amen.